Okay, hello everybody, welcome to game number 25 against vampires. That's interesting, isn't it? He might get a wizard here with uh Oh no, he's got he's got two. <laughs> two thrall journeymen. Uh an adjup vamp. An adjup thrall. Who's also niggled? Yeah. And a move up vampire. Vampire is a good replace movement, he has not taken block. He has taken movement strip. That is horrendous. And then he's got a pro block nickeled guy. I'm guessing his record isn't great. I could be wrong. 717. That's not bad actually with, with vamps. <laughs> oh, and he's got just enough for the wizard. Oh, that's so unfair. That's so unfair. That's so unfair. Oh, he hasn't got it anyway. Hello, Satatoad. Yeah, the Pomvans are legendary, aren't they? Yeah, that's Carl. Cool. Yeah, it's already a thing, yeah. So he went for a babe and a bribe instead of a wizard. I've got to say, I'm much happier to see a babe and a bribe than a wizard. Pajim, je suis tout excité. Oh, mais contrôle toi, Bob. Au moins jusqu'à la première sortie. C'est parti pour du Blood Bowl! In G, indeed, G23. Yeah, there's CC, there's ranked and uh, casual, and casual is is what you want there, but obviously it's terrible. Because it's only, it's only the dregs who don't play ranked play there, so it's, it's obviously horrific. You can't, no, yeah, you can, can you? Yeah, you can keep your team, yeah, I'm sure you can. I'm sure you can keep your team season after season in there, yeah. You, they reset the standings each month, but not the teams. Whereas in rank, they, they reset the teams. As well as the rankings. But they still reset the rankings every six weeks. Not that anyone ca should care about the rankings in casual, but there you go. They probably do. Alright, in defence again. And this setup again, I guess. Yeah. Why not? Oh, he hasn't got any dodge, actually, so let's go with that. God, I've got to start the art soon. I want to do a bit of the old JFW first. I'm doing a bit of the JFW, and then I've got to sort out all the uh, the schedule stuff, all the Patreon stuff. The wrestling stuff, the liveries, fry racing, and then I'm going to just start doing art every day. Tend to not get there that much, Satterfield, but yeah, tackle because they're faster, aren't they? Yeah, exactly. Smithy. Smithy, it's a kind of pointless, isn't it, the round? Oh, 
Ranked is like a bit silly because it's like only uh, it's only the people who aren't playing CCL, isn't it? Which is like you've got to think why the hell aren't you playing that? So it's it's obviously going to be rife with conceding because if you're even vaguely competent or vaguely care about playing games, then you're going to play another one. That like that's the problem with it, isn't it? Yeah, the start again is lame. I agree that that's lame. But hopefully if they have redrafting, like they could do redrafting between the seasons. Which would be okay. But I guess he's going to foul every turn, isn't he, with the bribe? It's fair enough, he could get lucky. He's not going to foul this turn. <laughs> Wanker. <laughs> <laughs> I could blitz him into there and get an extra hit. That's quite nice, isn't it? Cheeky little move here. <laughs> and push him. <laughs> well, that was fucking worth it, wasn't it? Runs fails the pick up, glorious. Well, thank you, Satterfield. I enjoyed it. I certainly enjoyed it. <laughs> and on a push, could have just pushed him into a mighty blow hit as well. So it's like had double, double things happening. Kiwi not. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Femi. I do like that, to be honest. I do like I like that aspect as well. Like, it's funny because people, some people think that like people who are competitive must be completely, completely, uh, you know, try hard as they say and not care about anything and all this. But yeah, of course. I mean, everyone who plays blood ball likes that aspect of it, don't they? I think. Yeah, I don't. I, I, it would be interesting to see how many would would think of it. And I mean, I don't think there was much. I think it was the right thing to do. Like, I don't think there was any cost in doing it. So I think it was the right play. So it would be interesting to see how many would do it. Like, obviously, I think I'm one of the best. <laughs> but whether that's one of the best is top one percent or top. 10% or whatever, who knows? Or top 20%, but top something percent, isn't it? Every, everybody's top something percent. <laughs> this this foul's uh, horrible. Hello, Calcium. I don't know. I don't know calcium because it would depend how they would do it. Isn't it? This is an annoying big foul. That's really annoying. Um. 
it would depend how they did it. And of course, that move, the cost of that move was putting that guy up there who then got fouled to death. So doing that move cost me a dead blitzer. Yay. Um, yeah, it depends. It depends how they implemented the redrafting, I guess, Kelsey. Because there's multiple ways they could implement the redrafting, isn't there? So. This is wonderful anyway, isn't it? Getting out bashed by... Uh, by fucking shithead vampires. Wonderful. He must be on it, so this person. Does he stay? <laughs> Gets him out on a six because of his niggle. <laughs> Yeah, I like the concept. Um, it's weird. With, without redrafts, it's metal because you can make like 3k TV teams. So, I think you kind of have to have redrafts to make it in any way enjoyable. <laughs> It's how they do that, isn't it? You know, that's that's going to be the thing. Like it's going to be weird if they just have redrafts every six weeks, you know, and like you can't get back into the next season unless you've redrafted. That's going to be pretty crappy because you're still going to make a three K TV team, and then you're going to like keep a horrendously min max thing with some like you know legends or whatever, and then. Or like, you know, Calcium's going to have a... Calcium, not Calcium. Um, Crucifer's going to have a guy, like a legend chalk blocker who's taken all randoms and has Claw Mighty guard stand firm. <laughs> right, so he's only casting... <laughs> guard Mighty stand firm Claw and he's only casting like 100 t 120 TV. Um... And he'll keep him for like, you know, multiple seasons and stuff. So like and and not even Christopher, in fact, everyone will have that eventually, right? So it's just gonna be weird. It'd be really weird. Yeah, loads more money per game as well. Loads more money per game. No more palm, no more niggles. Niggles don't do anything. That's like incredible. No. I think that's a crazy idea, Kelsey. <laughs> Good. Why couldn't you have done that on the first one instead of killing a bloody blitzer, asshole? <laughs> oh, all the in all the infos there, uh, Calcium. We've got all of the like you know everything was spoiled. But, um, oh, he's bloodlusted, glorious. Yeah, Frost, I don't care. That, I mean, that is the good thing. Like, even though that was a really nice blitzer, who gives a shit? Like, that's the great thing. It is dwarf, and I just really don't care because 
dwarves don't care if their blitzer dies. Even a block, even a guard mighty blow, stand firm guy dying just doesn't like longbeard dying just doesn't even matter. Pretty glorious. <laughs> you get hit. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, he can. All right, well, he's, he's gonna get hit then, isn't he? Because I could have made the screen better, couldn't I? Le porteur risque le plaquage. C'est le genre de situation que j'adore. Si l'autre équipe part, je suis pas les Imbécile, indeed. <laughs> Yeah, it's just weird. There's no POM. There's like, there's no, niggling injuries aren't even bad in the new rules. Um, yeah, it was a terrible apple. Because he's still stunned. And he's still got to deal with this dwarf. Because he completely he dedicated five players <laughs> to a foul on armor nine thick skull. Yeah, Niggles is absolutely, they're absolutely fine because they don't affect the match. So the fact that they have no effect on the match means you can just keep them until they die. So they're amazing. Not not a problem at all. You keep every, every niggling injury you get. <laughs> oh God, Tony, don't say that. <laughs> don't say that, Tony. Unfortunately, yeah, it's hard to keep this guy in because this fucking hatch five. Maybe I should have. Uh, couldn't really want it. Didn't want a GFI. Hey! He's failed the dice roll. It's only a one. -er. Doesn't even pow! Glorious! It's got a dodge GFI and pickup. No, he doesn't. <laughs> he just doesn't. <laughs> Alright then. And he gets removed, of course. The rando, the rando thing that I did to keep his fast guy out of the p turn, out of the play for a turn, gets punished with a KO. Wonderful. Don't make any jokes. No jokes. Nothing of that ilk. Okay. Both of you. No jokes like that. Half fast racing indeed.
Might as well do the Randall block first. Absolutely no effect. And a power here is amazing. A push is not amazing. <laughs> oh, fail the hands pick up. Great stuff. <laughs> Make the dodge and fail the Shurans. Fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, Tony. Don't don't make any of those kinds of jokes, all right? Just because it's vaguely similar to another word, you know. Just don't. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good, Kelsey. I can't believe he didn't go for the pickup last turn. Like, I thought he had to go for the pickup. And he just didn't, but then obviously failed the sure runs for the touchdown. <laughs> Wonderful. If you know your opponent's going to roll shit, you don't have to make the plays, do you? <laughs> He's just gonna fucking lob it. He fucking is as well. <laughs> oh, he gets the perfect. Are you shitting me? The literal perfect scatter. I can't believe it. I really want to hit him with mighty blow. <laughs> wow. No re-roll those, I don't even want to do the GFIs, do I? Have to do the GFIs. Getting hired unless he gets MVP or a Kaz or an interception. 
or a touchdown. It was a great move though, wasn't it? Because otherwise he would have just gone 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, GFI and got the uh, system. Vampires can be a bit tricky for dwarves, can't they, with the, so many strength four? Like, it's hard to actually deal with the vampires. Obviously, thralls are, like, tailor-made for dwarves. Oh, he's just going for the 1D. He's got strip, but it's no good. <laughs> sure hands. Sure and how about that? Uh, yeah, case would trigger bloodlust. Yeah, I mean he, he didn't fail bloodlust. He failed his PFI. Get now bashed by. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> by vamps here, <laughs> just quietly. <laughs> two KOs and a Kaz versus two KOs. Don't worry, it's not like my entire team's got fucking mighty blow or anything. I thought it was the ball carry, it makes much more sense to do him. Imbecile. <laughs> oh god, that's <laughs> so unfortunately the the other the the loner who made the amazing play is not getting hired, but the other one might be. Okay, I want the extra KO rolls done. Oh yeah, neither one of the blitzer, yeah. Oh yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> yeah, good thing he up with the KO, yeah. Dof, 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 dof. Hello, physics. By the way, I had a, I had a go of your character, a go of your character, that sounds rude. Um, I'd put some work into your wrestling uh, 
wrestler in JFW, so I can have a look at that after after the dof 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 dof. <laughs> I didn't even notice when it said dof actually never fails, but there you go. Hello. Yeah, you did. You did win the tag belts. Ridiculously beat, beat Dimmy and Jimmy. No, it didn't beat Das Hats. Das Hats beat Dimmy and Jimmy. Das Hats beat Dimmy and Jimmy. And then you beat Das Hats. I got there in the end, humorous champ. Hard actually. It's hard to actually stop, isn't it? The bloody. Uh, the Edge 5 and the uh, Move 7, like either one of those are pretty good. Um, you don't have those shit moves, no. No. You are maybe overpowered. Because <laughs> um, <laughs> I've done a very clever and amusing thing. Maybe not. Maybe not clever. Maybe not amusing. But I've done a thing. Um. There's a wrestler, I don't know how much you know about wrestling. There's a wrestler called Neville. Uh, well, it's not, he's called Pac now. And, but he, he's the man that gravity forgot, right? So what perfect, what better, what more perfect wrestler to base <laughs> Newton on than the man who gravity forgot, right? Um, and he's very small. Um, He's very short, um, and he's like a high flyer dude. Um, so it's quite funny, and he's got long hair and a, and like a goatee. So it's quite funny to make him basically the opposite, <laughs> in like a giant dude, um, with basically in. And he's ugly, and he's called Neville. Yeah, he's really ugly. He looks like a fucking troll from Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Oh, of course he doesn't get a push. What what is even the point in stand firm, honestly? And this one can just dance through because he's bloody edge five. With dodge. Ooh. He's out of rerolls at least. That's good, isn't it? Something. <laughs> I don't know. Is is muscle building genetics are pretty good? Humorous chip. To be fair, I mean, obviously he's rided up to the fucking eyeballs. Don't get me wrong, but still, as far as uh, as far as muscles go, he's all right. Yes, he's, he has got... I, I don't think he does have a huge wang. There is a guy with a huge wang. I can't remember his name. Yeah, he's at least got a 2 plus to... Uh, he's at least a 2 plus to score, isn't he? <laughs> oh, well, he didn't dodge through! He's only got one scoring threat! What a mad cunt! I guess technically two. But he's easy, easily dealt with, isn't he, actually? GFI, so I don't want to block with that. I don't want to blitz without block. And then he can't get around. I don't want to double GFI. Hmm. 
I could have chained him back there, but I'd rather be more sure of getting the vampire down. He was much more likely to score, isn't he? You can tag him. One, two, three, four, five. Gee, if I could tag him. You could double GFI over there. Alright, so he wants to. What, one GFI in? Nah. One GFI, then maybe another one. Funny, isn't it? If he scores here, fair play to him. <laughs> yeah, but I couldn't take the boat down then, could I, hey, Dev? That was the thing about the runner. Couldn't take the ball down with the runner. Well, I could have taken the ball down, but then I don't put, get the push on him. And then, if what if I push him? Then I don't knock him over. So, I what do I even do on a push or a ball down? Take the ball down, maybe get my runner killed. I think it was right not to blitz with a runner. He's not even trying to score, is he? Well, I guess he's not trying to score. Glorious. Glorious. Yeah, if I had block, I would have blitzed with a runner, obviously. It's just a tour, isn't it? Just a tour. Turn eight, physics. He received and just uh, <laughs> and just left his left his ball carrier in, in range for no reason. Yeah. So turned him over and need this guy back and need his to stay out. At least his vamp to stay out. He's back and the vamp's back. Wonderful. He's down at 10 though. He only had 11 men. <sighs> wow. Welcome to the stream, Physics and uh, Papa Piccolo. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I can see you're new here. You've never seen a Jimmy Fantastic stream before. 
<laughs> no, I mean, I'm not going to do one. Not, not in the first half with like him no threat of scoring a touchdown or anything. No way. If it was, if it was, uh, if it was turn seven, then yeah, foul all day. But not when there's like no positional advantage or whatever to be gained. It's just almost certainly going to be a send off for not even well for a stun or a KO that recovers, isn't it? Like second half. Fouls like that are much better, aren't they? Because if you get the... Uh... Yeah, he would. <laughs> he certainly would have done physics, yeah. <laughs> He'd foul like Gengar. <laughs> oh, sorry, can't see him. It was great, though. It was a great run. Fucking Gengar. Who the fuck is Gengar? <laughs> oh, man. Glorious. I'm not right, Tony. I, I could swear I'd given them all mighty blow, but it doesn't look like it, does it? It really doesn't look like they all have mighty blow. That's all right, isn't it? Pretty happy with that. Dove, dove, dove. Hey. Instant AV break. Bit of morning. Worked wonders. Okay, maybe not wonders. But did something. Woo! <laughs> Our resident Klingon. Hello. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> That was too funny. Fucking Hancock. <laughs> right. <laughs> and if you don't know what the fuck we're on about, watch Among Us. <laughs> Please, Kazim. Oh. Is this right? What if he goes there? That's probably better, isn't it? Or he could just go a little bit further back to make the vamps a non factor. For a turn. And then hopefully make another removal or two. That was a, that was a good turn actually, wasn't it? Two removals off the LOS. Down to eight men. Limited thralls. This dirty player's looking pretty shitty now. Can't really afford to throw any fouls out with only with only eight players and four of thralls. So he's in a bit of it's a, he's in a bit of a tricky spot. Also, the uh, dwarf is getting 
block or dodge, isn't he? Now that's nice. Or strength or agility, I guess. Or movement. He's getting a stat block or dodge. So that's pretty good. Didn't gaze. That was a uh, suboptimal, wasn't it? Okay, so he does foul anyway. <laughs> oh well, what do I know? <laughs> Clearly nothing. Three, four. Yeah, I think that's the better way of doing it. And he comes off to screen against this vampire. He did not know he had two uh, two journeymen, in fact. That's pretty cool, Necrompoons. <laughs> oh, glorious. What's a BB3 banner? I'm not sure I should be this confused. <laughs> oh, brilliant. No weird stuff. <laughs> if it's offensive towards anyone except Skavens, you'll be disqualified. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> That's fantastic. Can just use my fucking Twitter one. That's already, I've already, mine's already made. <laughs> I can just, I can just put that in, can't I? Just use this. Ask for a free copy, can't I? I got, I got, I got Blood Bowl too from being on the, well, alpha testing team. That was nice. Don't even have to score here, do I? I just got to defend it against the bloody vamps. I'm definitely not going to play Fumble. <laughs> I can tell you that. Uh, yeah, Dev. I'm definitely not playing Fumble. Des 
There's no time limit because there's no time limit in the rules and uh, fumble plays by the rules. No matter how stupid that is in an online computer game. <laughs> right, I could 2D the relevant throw, but I think it's much more much more important to 1D this guy. Things he could fucking gaze and hit the ball and what have you. Oh, the fucking t honestly, the people on tabletop who hate having to play with four minute turns can just go fuck themselves. Honestly, like fuck off, just fuck off. Everyone who can't fucking play, just fuck off. <laughs> It's the worst thing about tabletop in both Blood Bowl and Warhammer and 40k. It's all the same. That's, it's what put me off playing 40k. I went to a few 40k tournaments. There was a time when we were playing Blood Bowl tournaments and Warhammer tournaments and 40k tournaments and I eventually stopped because I just got cheated by somebody taking forever. It just pissed me off. Just stalling, running the clock down is like the worst fucking way. To play, isn't it? It's disgusting. Does that stop me playing Blood Bowl? Uh, 40k. Well, it stopped me playing everything, in fact. Man, he doesn't give a shit, does he, this guy? Yeah, exactly, yeah, exactly, yeah. <laughs> hey, you rolled a one. <laughs> and he's cast. <laughs> that's the best way, in a team, with a team full of mighty blow, that's the best way for me to get removals. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> How does that even work? Oh, I probably should have put the stand firm down at the end. I don't really want to do it, do it. He can do things he wants. He's only got how many players? Five players left. <laughs> right, he can go for a handoff here. To this guy. Yeah, four minutes is ridiculous when you don't have to roll any dice and stuff. What tip? Honestly, tabletop blood bowl's a bit wank though, because people fucking. Like, people can't ever get caught out by a tackle zone even. You know, what? what's the worst thing, right, is reading these idiots who, who write in, like, you know, Blood Bowl 3 Discord and fucking CCL General and stuff, and they say, oh, well, in, it's rubbish having the pathing, because in tabletop, you've got to make your own pathing, and you can't just, uh, you know, you, you've got to use your own... And it's like, no, you don't need to use any brains in tabletop, because if you fuck up, 
Then you just say, oh, sorry, yeah, I won't dodge then. It's fucking bullshit, and it pisses me off. And they spend about 14 hours fucking checking everything. Like, Jesus Christ. I hate that. And and now they've made that official as well. About Take-backs are in the fucking rules as well. In the new rules, you've got to let people take everything back. I mean, for fuck's sake. It's just the worst idea ever. It's completely the worst fucking idea ever, honestly. I hate it. I genuinely hate that aspect of tabletop. You playing fucking purple goo. The fucker finally makes a mistake. Oh, guess what? You've just got to fucking take it back. You've got to let him take it back as well. Fuck off. I forgot I was going to cage up and I forgot I was going to hand off. Never mind. Time limits in a bloody like online PC game, not having time limit, like it's crazy, isn't it? That even the thought of it is just insanity. You absolutely shouldn't have any take back. It's the worst. Yeah, dice rolls means no take back, but no okay, and if you go like this guy will move here, right? Someone will say, someone will do that, right? Someone will just do a move. They just move their vampire, right? And they'd go one, two, three, and you'd say, that's a dodge. And then they'd say, all oh, right, sorry, one, two, three, four, five, six. And it's like, fuck you. You've got to make your dodge, you cunt. <laughs> so you, you can't take back after there's dice, but you can take back all moves and like, and you go, this guy will dodge, and then, uh, and then you'll say, okay, and then you roll a four, and then you'll go like diamond tackle. So you can get you can get them with diamond tackle and stuff. But if they don't see to dodge, or if you go, if I'll make this block, and then like even if if you make this block and they roll two dice, right, then you say he's got guard. It's one dice. Then they go, oh, I won't block it. I won't do it then. So like you know, just things like that, man. It's fucking bullshit. It's the most bullshit bullshittery on earth. Fucking dickheads. Right, I just wanna hit this guy. Yep, yep, hey Dev, that happens a lot, yeah. It's honestly it's horrific. It's proper like People who complain about CCL being, uh, you know, bad in any way, and they fucking idolise table. All these people who like idolise tabletop and stuff and shit on CCL, just need to fuck off honestly because it's uh, tabletop is fucking bullshit. <laughs> Yeah, they absolutely do that. Yeah, it's not. It, honestly, genuinely, I've had people do that to me a lot, and I've I've hardly fucking played tabletop. I couldn't even stand going to a lot of tabletop. It's just horrible. And how do you, how does he how do clocks even work as well? Like it's crazy. Like that would be frantic as you go. Right, he'll block you, <laughs> and then he'll go. All right, so I'll choose to use dodge then, and then you've got to switch it, and then go. <laughs> Let me. All right, I've got, I'm going to sidestep. All right, click click the thing. 
Right, I'll sidestep to there. I want to use the apothecary. All right, click the thing. I'm not that kind of boss. It's not even on your turn. It's not even on your turn, though, is it? That's the thing. Oh man, he's used gears. He's got. He's in. Oh, they absolutely do though, Satterfield. They absolutely do. It's horrible. Oh, fuck off. I knew I should have blitzed the wrestler. God damn it. God damn it. I just wanted to hit his good vampire. I guess I should have hit the wrestler. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's horrible, man. And I really hate the no, the no fucking illegal procedure. They totally got rid of that. The best game I ever had on tabletop was when uh, I agreed to use illegal procedure with my opponent. We both agreed on it, and it was glorious because we both thought about what turn it was instead of just me thinking about what turn it was. Oh yeah, he's wrestled, wasn't he? Can't even score now, fuck's sake. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, it's all it's all down to the fucking TT people. I, kn I knew it was. <laughs> oh, Pedro! Yeah, it's it's done. It's done. It's just uh, he had vampires. He killed he killed a fucking thirty SPP blitzer, which which <laughs> would make me feel bad if this was a chaos team. But seeing as I don't care about the team at all, it's alright, isn't it? He has, hasn't he? Yeah. Yeah, that's the thing, it's fine. It's literally fine. Like, that's the stupid thing. It's literally fine on dwarves. Because you just get a bloody rookie dude, and he's great. And. You're happy. Whereas with Dwar with with bloody uh, chaos, you're like, all oh, right, now why why even try? You fucking shithead! You fucking lost. Fuck off, stopping me getting my skills. Fuck you. Roll another skull, you prick. Fuck off. Why do people do this? Like honestly, fuck you. You haven't got a scoring threat. Just fuck off. <laughs> Sorry. And he's even tagged him as well. Oh my fucking god. It's a fucking one. <sighs> ah, you fucking wanker! Right. Anyway, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not mad. I didn't care about this game at all. Um, 
<laughs> Woo! Flip me, guys. That was a fun one. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear <laughs> I could have just blitzed him couldn't I and put him there but then I'd, he was in I guess he could have blocked him <laughs> yeah exactly Storm that's what was pointless that was what was pointless in doing it he just stopped he just stopped my long beard leveling. Good for him. Good for him. I mean, to be fair, I often find myself trying to stop people scoring when it doesn't matter. It's easy to do. Oh, the other one leveled. Like I don't really, I don't really hate him for doing it or anything. It's just frustrating, isn't it? When it and I, only mildly frustrating. If you can't, if you can't get that I was joking there, then uh, I apologise. But um. It was just a bit of fun, wasn't it? But it is it is kind of mildly annoying when when that sort of thing happens. All right, got four mighty blows, so now I can go stand firm first. The rebel, uh, the rebel skill of choice. I didn't mean to buy the two SPP loaner num nuts here, Dev, because I I got my blitzer die, didn't I? So I've got to replace the blitzer. Num nuts. Right, so buy a blitzer and then an extra stand firm. Ah, oh, but then had a stand firm die, so never mind. Right, 1744, not bad. That was all just a joke. Obviously, I, I do that a lot, and I always think, why am I even trying to stop the score? I've already lost 1 0, it doesn't matter if I lose 2 0. Definitely if you're trying to get a counter score, obviously, out of it, but I find myself doing that all the time. I was just. Just having a bit of a joke there. Right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.